Hey guys, it's Gabi, and today we're making one of my go-to weeknight dinners, lemon chicken pasta. This is one of those things you can make for kids, you can make it for adults, anybody who might be a picky eater or not. I mean, it's that good. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna boil off some linguine. A whole pound of linguine serves like six people. We're just gonna do two thirds of it for today, which is roughly 10 ounces. Okay, so we're just gonna put our linguine into some pasta water. All right, so just twist the pasta around until it's all submerged, and we're just gonna let that cook for about nine to 10 minutes until it's al dente. Meanwhile, let's turn a skillet over high heat. And notice this is a large skillet, and we need this because we're putting a lot of mushrooms in. We're gonna start with just a couple tablespoons of olive oil and let that heat up. We're just gonna add some garlic and some shallots into the olive oil so as that continues to heat up, the olive oil will get infused with all of that flavor, which is kind of the base to any good recipe, right? And before the garlic like burns or anything like that, we wanna put the mushrooms in, throw all these in. But we're looking for like a really nice caramelized color. Like you want it to be golden brown and like a little golden on the edges. I'm just gonna go ahead and season this with some salt and pepper. It's really important to season as you go instead of just at the end. Okay, these are looking good and they're starting to get some color, which is exactly what we want. But while it's going, we're gonna add the chicken right into the mushroom mixture. Don't freak out, this is how you're supposed to do it. And when we cut the chicken, just make sure you cut it into like bite-sized pieces because you're gonna twirl these around some pasta in a minute. So just use the back of your spoon and break it all up. Make sure everything has like ample real estate in the skillet. And then we're gonna cook all of this until the chicken's done and then assemble. Let's go ahead and give this a little seasoning as we go. So while the chicken and the mushroom mixture is going, I have my cool handy dandy little cat oven mitt. We are going to drain off the pasta. We can just put this right on our cutting board and then the pasta is gonna go back in here and we're just gonna let it hang out until the chicken mixture is ready to go. Chicken and mushroom mixture is done. Oh my God, this smells insane. Just dump it right into the pasta, juices and all. And then with your tongs, just mix everything together. And we're going to finish this off with a couple things. First up, chives. If you can't find chives, you can use parsley. Then we need some lemon zest, which we zested earlier. All right, then we're gonna add in some lemon juice and then we'll season it with a little bit of salt, some red pepper flakes to give it a little bit of a kick, some more ground black pepper. And then the last ingredient we need is just like an Italian cheese blend. I think this is just like Parmesan and Romano and I don't really know what else, but it's delicious. Like any of the packaged ones are fine. Just dump that all in and then take it all. We'll just go ahead and mix it all up. And I mean, <laughs> Look at that, you can like see the cheese dripping off of that. All right, so we'll just serve some of this up in a bowl. So just twirl it up. Make sure you have some chicken on there. And it's the perfect bite. Hmm. I mean, it's so good. Oh, so happy.